Hey everybody, Orpheolus here. Welcome back to some more Chicory Colorful Tale. Last time, well, we fought ourselves the boss of Chapter 4, our Shadow Selves, and apparently something major is going on inside, uh, Luncheon. Well, not, yeah, Luncheon. So this time, we'll be heading here and, um, seeing what is going on, so... Things are going to be very intense here. As you can tell, well, things are getting more and more intense. So here we get ourselves a massive tower. Before we head inside to talk to Chicory, we have the ability to climb which we gained last episode. Alright then. Um, care to explain? This is the largest corruption I've ever seen. It sprouted here so suddenly. You won't be able to enter as you are now. Your bond with the brush isn't strong enough. Go back down and speak to Chicory. There is no way to put this lightly. This is an utterly catastrophic situation. A corruption this big could quickly spread across all the picnic. You and Chicory need to do something about this. Immediately. So, yeah, something big and powerful here. Well, let's go head on inside. So prepare yourself for a fight. So, let's head on in. Chicory? Can you hear me? Are you okay? I mean, I know you're probably not. Chicory, something horrible is going on. The Black Forest is spreading, every spreading everywhere. And it's starting to sound, look and talk like me too. It isn't safe here anymore. Please, you have to come out. Chicory? Are you? Oh, the door's open. You came back. Chicory, you need to get out of this tower. It's not safe anymore. Something horrible is happening here. I'm what's happening here. I told you. All this is coming from me. I'm just a broken, messed up person. You can't save me from this. The sooner you abandon me, the better off you will be. Chicory, I... None of that is true. Last time I saw the darkness, it... Why won't you listen to me? It, it's, it's all my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. Chicory. All right, so welcome to the Chicory fight. This fight is definitely something. You can't damage it. All right then, so just wait for the arrows to go, go past. All right, we'll bite down here. Just stay in the middle. Okay then, let's get down here to the bottom. Okay then. So doing another cycle of the arrows. Okay. Starting to get uh, munching down. Okay. Let's get out of the middle and we'll be good there. Chicory, please listen. This darkness isn't just you. You started looking and speaking like me too. It must be something else. Then why did it all come out when I had the brush? Why did all the color vanish? You think you did that? No, but... Stop making excuses for me! My entire reign as wielder was a mistake! The only good thing I ever did was pass it on to you! So forget about me! I'll just make everything worse! Alright, so on to phase two now. Okay then, so starting to munch things up here, so you just gotta be quick with your movements, just kind of let it go across the screen here. So yeah, so this fight is essentially an auto-scroller. Okay, so starting to get to the arrows here. Okay then, just stay out of the middle. Okay, just kind of doing that. Just kind of go along the perimeter here, until it stops scratching and... Oh, I Who says you can do that? Yeah, so once again, this fight is challenging and also annoying at the same time. So that's what happens when you fall, you essentially just restart the phase. Okay, just gotta stay out of the middle. So yeah, so you essentially just restart the phase? Okay. I remember to stay out of the middle this time. Okay then, so next step is doing cross there. So yeah, so that's the annoying part of the fight is just the closet, stay there. Chicory, you. 
You really think I'm a better wielder than you? Of course you are! But, when I saw that part of you in the swamp, you said you regret giving me the brush to me. I regret a lot of things. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't know why I'm saying something so stupid. Just another mistake. Nothing good comes from me. Why would you even want me around? Alright, so moving on to the third and final phase. Okay then, so just kind of do another scratching phase here. So yeah, so there's two claws here. So again, this fight I would say is the hardest fight in the game. Okay, so get out of the way there. Okay, do another claw phase here. Okay. Oi. Okay then. So yeah, so this is probably the worst part here. Gotta get out of the way here. Okay. Run there in the middle. Okay, hang out there in the middle. Get out of the way. Chicory! Just go! They're better off without me! All these problems came from me. I don't care where they came from. I can't face it all alone anymore. I need your help. I won't abandon you. So stop asking me to. Please. I'm not going anywhere. I'm here. Just breathe. You... You've seen yourself in there, too. Yeah. It's... It spoke like it was me. And it said stuff I was thinking. So something came from me. But if it came from you... And from me, too... Then it's something coming between us. It must have been. The brush. The brush! When I was wielding the brush... It was like it was connected to me. The more my bond with it grew, the more I could do with it to shape and color reality. But I wonder if it made more things real than just that. Pancake. I'm so, so sorry for whatever you heard in the swamp. That's not who I want to be. When those corruptions talk to me, it's like all my self-doubts came true, reminding me of every mistake I've made. Chikri, you're so much more than that. It hurts to hear you talk about yourself that way. I forgive you. I just wish I could help. Well, more than that, I want to be your friend. I thought by now you hated me. I thought you hated me. I'm so sorry. I just dropped you into this giant mess. I need to be better. I'm gonna try. I need you to wield the brush. Center all the corruption in Picnic. It's at the top of this tower. But you aren't ready to face it yet, because you haven't become a proper wielder yet. I haven't. That's my fault. There's a series of five wielder trials. Well, one was in the wielder temple, which you already did. So, four wielder trials, one at each corner of Picnic. That's how you're meant to bond with the brush. And that's how you could reach, it, reach that last step. From now on, I'm going to be your teacher. I can't promise I'll be perfect, but I'm at least going to try. Okay? What are the trials? Each trial explores a different aspect of being a wielder. You'll find one at each corner of Picnic. The aim will be to commune with the brush in different ways, so your bond with it is strong as it can be. Okay? Bonding with the brush seems to be bad. I do think bond with the brush somehow made the corruptions. And your bond too, but everyone's in danger from now now from the corruptions. And we can't fight them without bonding with the brush. So right now we don't have a choice about it. We need to fix this mistake first. And decide what to do with the brush later. 
Okay. I'm gonna fight the giant corruption. Unfortunately, yeah. The little ones you've been fighting aren't making a difference, so we have to attack it at the source. It's the only way to get rid of it all for good. It's going to be way harder than anything you've done yet. Okay. How do I find them? Each trial is at the furthest reaches of Picnic. To explore out there, and you'll find them. Use your map. Or if you're really in a pinch, you can always phone for help at a phone booth. Okay. Okay. You look nervous. <laughs> I'm not. It's okay if you are. I was too. And I was under a lot less pressure. I can do it! I want to be stronger. I want to learn how to be a real wielder. And help out everyone. And help you too. I can do it. Okay. Come find me at one of the trials. You can do it, Pancake. Alright, and with that, essentially, the second half of the game is now open. Crazy to think we're halfway done with the game already. But yeah, with this all done, the game is wide open now. Like, instead of it being just a linear jaunt, it's now wide and expansive. So, here, I'm gonna head and dressing up. So now we have the ability to do the next part of the Oats quest. You either need the Spike Helmet or the Spike, and then the Tuxedo. Whoa! Your outfit is it. It's exactly what I've been looking for. For that, here's something cool. And we get ourselves aviators. I kinda like aviators. I'm looking for a new outfit now. A dinosaur professor. That's a new outfit I'm looking for. Alright, which we won't be able to get to for a little bit. Alright, so with that all done, we'll be doing a little bit of exploring this episode. Yeah, to be honest. Oh, one thing before I go into like a long little speech um, here to wrap up the episode. On top of Macaroon's house, you might notice if you're as I'm like kind of walking here that there is like an invisible wall here if you if you were not able to get the um, out the uh, headwear from Macaroon at the start of the game and he moves on to it to well talking about the corrupted forest you'll be able to get the present on top of his house so yeah that's all that there so I guess as we're kind of like overlooking things here I will say I definitely feel for trickery I do. I mean, kind of when I was first playing this game, I was going through a very rough time myself. And just voicing all my frustrations there. In fact, I'm still kind of going through a rough time, just in a different way. And the theme, Abandon Me, is probably my favorite theme in the game, and it's a hard-hitting theme. Just like the intro and all that stuff, it's what it feels like to be alone. Alone in the world where everyone abandoned you, mostly. Feeling like you've abandoned yourself also. Just that theme of isolation and everything like that, and... And all that stuff, I definitely feel for Chicory. Just going through my inner demons and all that stuff. Feeling like I'm not worth it. To my parents, I'm... I love them and everything, and I know they love me, but... In a way, my inner demons feel like I'm nothing to them, and just... Feel like I'm nothing to everyone. It's kind of how I feel about that, too. Even though I do have friends, and I know they're supporting me. Even when things kind of feel bleak in this dark time. Definitely is something, and it's kind of going through. Hopefully, Chikri does get better here, as we get to know more about, about her. So yeah, just that entire sequence, it it's intense. So yeah, I just kind of wanted to talk about that and all that stuff. I mean, I, mean, I have had other Let's Plays where I kind of talk about my inner inner demons and all that stuff. Yeah, just see um, a Pokemon, uh, my brain can think, Sword and Shield, um, Hop Springs anew. That one, I definitely go into it much deeper on. So yeah, so here... Just a lot of stuff going down. So, before we wrap up the episode off, I do want to grab this thing for backwards. So, yeah, so this is definitely a well hit corner and just the world's really beginning to open up. So, yeah. Well, that's definitely a lot of darkness for one day, so I think I'm going to wrap up the episode here because, holy heck, there is a lot of stuff that we can do right now. Like, a lot. So, next time in Chicory, well, we'll begin exploring with our new brush technique heading on into the southeast. Since we have the four wielder trials, to be exact, we got one probably um, somewhere right up in here, somewhere down in here, somewhere over in here, and somewhere over in here. At least if I had to take a guess, and since we have the ability to swim, well, essentially, the world is now your oyster. I will see you all in the next one.